Minasan konnichiwa, this is Matt Okahara from the Matsumoto Castle Gun Corps and today we're going to look at gunpowder. Gunpowder consists of three components, sulfur, charcoal and saltpeter. Saltpeter being a historical name for potassium nitrate. All of these components were readily available during the samurai era. And without them, the firearms used by the Ashigaru and Samurai would have been absolutely useless. Modern powder, such as the powder we use at the Matsumoto Castle Gunko, however, contains synthetic components. Gunpowder is defined as a low explosive. Many people may have already heard the term high explosive and low explosive before, and we'll just talk a little bit about the difference between the two. High explosives, such as those that are used in modern military munitions, detonate faster than the speed of sound and thereby produce a shockwave. Low explosives have a subsonic detonation and this is important when it comes to shooting for several reasons. Firstly, it saves wear on the barrel, so gunsmiths and weapon designers do not have to overly insulate the barrel to ensure that it survives the battle. When the gunpowder is ignited, it creates light, heat, sound and pressure, all of which need to be managed within the weapon. Therefore, gunpowder as a low explosive is a lot more suitable for firearms. So now that we know a little bit more about gunpowder, let's talk about how it's used. In hojutsu, gunpowder falls into two categories. There is koryaku, the priming powder, and there is kayaku, which is the powder charge. Both types of powder are made from the same components. Koyaku, however, which is the priming powder, is ground down into a fine powder. This is then used to prime the weapon. By that, we mean it is put into the flash pan on the external firing mechanism. This is the ignition point for the gun. The ignition of the Koyaku allows the Kayaku charge inside the barrel to ignite as well. It instantly converts the powder into heat, light, pressure and sound, which is otherwise known as a gunshot. This rapid expansion of gas has nowhere to go other than forwards, and as it rapidly pushes itself down the barrel, it will take the bullet or any other projectile that is in there with it. Regarded as one of the four great discoveries of China, gunpowder is still relevant today. Don't forget to like and subscribe to find out more about the way of the gun and the Matsumoto Castle Gun Corps. <laughs>